Okay, so here we have the Eachine 250 racer and it's a part, it's coming apart because I'm going to replace these really useless little landing skids. They're made out of carbon fiber, but as you can see, I've already busted one. And if you're flying, they've just dangled it around and make all sorts of noise and rattle. So I'm going to replace them with this right here. This is a 3D printed landing skid and it's not made for the 250. It's actually made for this here, the Vortex 250. And if I flick over the back, you can see I've got the landing skids already installed on it. So how do I make those skids fit on this racer? Well, it's too easy. On the back, I'm gonna flip this over and I'll show you. I already put one in place. On the back, you have four little uh, screws and nuts. So you see, I only need two of them to be used here. Um, but the problem is if you just use two, trying to do this while looking through a camera, you're going to cover one of the nuts and there's no hole in the bottom. So I have to drill a hole in, down here so that it fits over nicely over this. And I also have to res reverse the nuts. You can see here, that's a nut, but that's a screw and that's a screw. The nuts are on the other side. I've just turned them around. All right, so here's how I do it. Okay, so first thing I've done, I made a little black mark on the bottom to show exactly where I have to drill a hole. All right, so we got the drill press here. Just place this underneath, crank this on. I'm gonna to have to hold it in place with my fingers. All right, there we go. We have a nice little hole in there and uh, that's where the nut will sit so that this can sit on top of it. Now let's put it on the Falcon 250 and get her flying. All right, I got three on, just getting the fourth one on. Hopefully it goes on nicely. Screw here. So there you go, all four are on. There we go, the landing gear is removed and uh, the new landing gear is in place. Looks pretty good. It should work well. You can slide along the bottom without touching the electronics that are shown back here. Should be good. All right. Much more quiet. Not as rattly sounding. All right, now to get outdoors and fly this thing and uh, crash it because that's what I seem to do. Till next time.